um, negative for you. I don't know. I don't want to say anything about that. But uh, it got to that point where. Yeah, when you say negative intake, that is kind of um, we have you mean negative intake. Negative intake, uh, alcohol abuse, negative. Um, marijuana, negative. Anything that has that something to do with drugs. Yeah, when you are always on control. At the long run, we go to the police station. Even the um, the so called, I mean, what do they call them? I mean, it's like the DPO of the station. When I anger starts, even six men can't hold on to the arm. A couple of me beating them. It's not possible. She uses everything she has. Everything I have destroys everything to zero. She uses everything she has. Okay. All I did was yeah, I held her and fought. Yeah. Even the police they were surprised. Yeah. She was part of the 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 I mean the what is it? I think one of them is part of I just go step for my own sake. When I uh, when she granted the last interview, I mean she mentioned uh, she mentioned Ghana Embassy, Ghana Police. Then that that, that event when when it took place, I covered everything. I took everyone's phone, I deleted every picture, I, I, mean, I closed everything in Canada. First of all, because she was a lady. So I didn't want anything to come out. But you know, just this interview, she mentioned uh, that she was, she was uh, beaten, and she ran to the office. Start making. Start making. And she ran to the police station. She's also popular in Ghana, and Ghana is where I live. I still have one of them in Ghana. I still have one of them in Ghana. So she actually mentioned that the media went to the police station. So as soon as I saw that, I decided to request for my own story. So to those people, Saying uh, I sponsor, you can't sponsor Ghana police. Because the person coming out from his office speaking on behalf of the complainer, you know, and really did not get out, you know, the man read the doctor, you know. I mean, they, nobody wants to put his job out there because it's not a promotion of him. So I just requested for mine, and this is the withdrawal letter. I don't know how to explain. She destroyed a lot of things. She, I mean, when she's, when she is, uh, when she is in that state, it's like another world. Even six men won't be able to stop her. The police people couldn't stop her. Are you saying? When she's angry. It's not when she's angry, there's one particular I mean there's one particular state due to uh negative English. So after this she was locked up and I wrote the withdrawal letter I gave her. I wanted her to increase my documents. So I just said to her. Going to jail. But she was stubborn up there. It was like, yo, you know. So that was it. So they went for her. I didn't report to you. I didn't, I didn't report. I only requested for my statement. 
That's, that was um, one of the main reasons why I even um, accepted to plan the interview. China police are not required, and uh, come to know what she told me when uh, I, I took her out from the cell of uh, oh, yeah, you forgive me, that means you are an angel. She promised never to go back to drugs or alcohol just after that. Then I requested for this um, withdrawal, I mean, for this statement and the withdrawal letter from Ghana. So I have, I have a statement and a withdrawal letter here. The withdrawal letter that uh, was written on the 9th of June when I when I paid for a bail, she was supposed to go to jail. She was supposed to go to court. She was supposed to go to jail. Why? Closed everything down from Ghana police. And I made it go to Belfast. I changed that completely. Just three months, I mean, three weeks after this event, she, she told me she was pregnant. Same month. So, um, when I heard, you know, that probably I sponsored Ghana police, and they had to request for a statement. So, I was glad that. Just after the uh, police station incident in Ghana, um, I bailed out, and I wrote an invitation to, to the, to the um, I mean, I wrote the withdrawal letter. She promised me never to abuse anything like drugs or alcohol. Then uh, we, were, we had an agreement. She stopped all of this and she took him three weeks after. She me. So all the way throughout my life, she was a perfect woman. She was a perfect person. Till she came back from the United States. She came. Now that like four months after, uh, I mean, till four months after uh, she gave her to me, she was perfect. Now she started it. So far, she's, uh, she's damaged over 66 million naira because of poverty. So I. I, I tried my best just to revive her back to who she was when she was pregnant or just immediately after she gave birth. But um, that's been the major problem. So um, I've tried and tried and tried and tried. I have evidences of um, some of the properties she damaged. Luckily, it wasn't very bad. I have somebody around country that monitors country and gives me updates about everything she does. Even when she calls bloggers, when she tries to blackmail me, when she sends information. Even when she sends information about uh, my, my, my manager. Travel to Ghana, she came to Ghana rather than then. So we weren't talking then. We had this, uh, like, after mom's incident, I decided to go to Ghana and to school up. So we weren't talking. I had my birthday and I had a charity to the other nation in Ghana. So I invited three of my staff. So she's, uh, I think she heard that my staffs came and one girl and two other boys. So uh, she, I mean, she decided to, to use um, the girl. I mean, I don't, someone gave me an information that she, 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 she wanted to use the girl to, to like blackmail or something. I was
Tonto said you hit King, your son. What led to this? How can I hit King? King? <laughs> No, it's not possible. Ken is not up to one year. He has a, he, he's a little boy that can't talk. What can a one year old boy do for you? That's not possible. Even uh, so the day before my son's death, I was still looking for him. I, I called the nanny. Fortunately for me, the nanny was not too sad to have my wife. So she picked up. I would like to pay this for her. Right the day before uh, King's birthday, and I got him. Uh, I got I got a GMC Jeep. That I was going to be able to like, arrange something good. Social media. I'm not a social media, a media kind of person, but I was forced to drop comments and to go somewhere because I was told I, my wife can only be found on social media. That's what she said. Uh, Toto showed several scars during the interview. She said you fitted on her. 
person. What do you have to say to that? And there was nothing like that. The only scar, the only scar I, I was aware about was the, um, the one on the left. So that uh, in uh, night of my mom's house, she was breaking stuff, but uh, we got to a point, she was coming towards me. And uh, her best friend was trying to hold, like, hold her back. That's the uh, uh, male best friend. That one was crying. Just like this, you never saw that kind of thing before. As if she was crazy. She already broke down everything television, kitchen utensils, uh, dispenser. I was in shock. Because, you know, uh, you've done this in my house up to four times, in uh, seven to eight months I've lost, I mean, I've lost over to the six million era. and this is my mom, this was in my mom's house, my mom's house, you know, she, I mean, I was like, she, she went to the extreme, so her best friend was trying to hold her, but she was coming towards me, so uh, her best friend, her best friend is uh, the, uh, the one that He was, he was, he was actually like crying. I told him, stop, what are you doing? What are you doing? What are you, what are you doing? I told him, you need to stop. You know, she, she just, she, 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 she put her leg in the glass. I mean, uh, the staircase. That's what she got. That's the video. That's what he got. That's what she got the coffee. Anything apart from that. I'm a philanthropist. I am against domestic violence. I have never raised my hand on any woman, and I will never. Stated that she lost her four months pregnancy uh, because of the um, abuse by you. There was nothing like that. Because um, I met her six months before she conceived. Then she uh, she was pregnant for another four months before she traveled. Okay, making nine months. She got back after nine months and she's been breastfeeding. And she just stopped breastfeeding like three weeks ago. So I don't, I mean, where's the pregnancy for? I don't understand. This woman told me earlier that she was going to um, get everything to bring me down. So she has the foundation and I have the foundation too. Other things are involved, but she's been trying everything. I have someone in a in a camp, someone close to her, that gives me all the updates. Even how she make uh, all the scars in her body look. She called somebody to to make up the scars. She made up the scars on her body. The only thing that happened to talk to her was the scar in my mom's house, and her best friend was the one. Holding out, crying. Turn to what are you doing? What are you doing? And she, 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 she caught herself. Have the glass. She, she hit her leg on the glass. You know. So I am not a woman with her. I can. I've never. I've never done that in my life, and I will never be any woman. I cannot do that. So she's trying everything hard because she knows I um, she knows I want a foundation and she knows the kind of person I am and she knows that okay this young man maybe is trying to be somebody in the future 
she's tried everything. She has everything, everything planned. I'm not an actor. I cannot act. I cannot cry. But everything, everything I watched was like 95% lying. The only, the only truth was that I loved my husband. I loved my husband. All that sexual transmitted disease, I don't even know. Not this millennium. The last time I had STD was in secondary school. Nobody, that isn't, nobody would just, I mean, when, when, when last day I STD? At this stage of my life, STD. No. She's just trying everything. That is, I mean, just, I don't know what she wants. I think, she, I think she's trying to stay um, out of marriage. She's tried everything. Because um, I was not even around when she moved from her house. She came with two trucks. She moved everything. And she said um, um, she left the house without nothing. She moved everything from the house. Everything. All that things was planned. She got another house. Till date, I don't even know where she stays. I tried even before King's birthday, but it was uh, so sad that um, she didn't give me answers on King's birthday. You know, even till date, because I tried to reconcile uh, a family and my family. I tried to reconcile us. For about nine times. The next time was just ten days ago. It was just ten days ago. And she always pretends and say, Oh, okay, oh, um, we're cool. As soon as they leave, she blocks me. She blocks my number. So I don't know what she wants. I don't know what she wants because, um, let me show you something. Just eleven days ago, Just 11 days ago, I invited a dad and the chiefs from uh, from uh, yeah, a dad and the chiefs from a uh, family. With Rosalie, maybe we'll pick. If she has a picture, let, let, let her get a picture. I don't even have a picture with Rosalie outside the country. We have group picture. So I don't know what she got. She's, I think she's, she's trying everything. She's 
trying to um, bring out everything to make sure she's trying to bring out everything that can nail me down. My wife had not told me right before that she doesn't know. 2014, 2015 scholarship. Um, she's major in anything that has to do with um, young ones and children or babies, mothers, mother and child. Uh, yeah. My wife actually knows all my workers. She knows everybody. So I don't know where it's going. But to the public, um, I saw something about one PA on uh, one blog. Like uh, my wife has a friend as a blogger. She starts with a uh, rumor as a, so I don't know. I think when she started uh, with all her. All our works against me. I think uh, she used uh, she used that against me. Has there been a scenario where you fought your mom or been abusive to her before verbally? Yes, verbally. But fuck my mom, no. But uh, the event that took place in my mom's house before the house wedding, I told you about. Where she got the scar on the leg. And, uh, you know, uh, I told you earlier that Tom Kuku is a temperamental. She is, she is like, she fights like um, maybe six in one. Like, God forbid, like a demon. Kind of, she breaks anything, she deals with anything. You cannot hold that purpose of beating that. So that wasn't uh, my mistake, but she was dealing with me. I won't say she was beating me because what she does is she jacks up club. She has to make sure everything. She strips you. You wear another one. You have to leave where she is. But I don't always like to leave her because she might get injured or something else. But when uh, I mean, that time, what happened was that my mom tried to, I mean, pull, pull me out. Or my mom tried to, she intruded. So she, she gave my mom the help and she fell. I was moving back to this guy, told my mom to me. So at that point, I thought that was extreme. You know? I didn't beat that. I just, Packed one or two things and I traveled to Ghana. Of which, don't worry, an event for the road construction in Abuja just two days after this uh, event that happened in my mom's house. Just two days. Two days after. Even in the sense, she, she beat my younger brother. I was trying to hold her. I'll show you the picture. She beat my younger brother. Two places, for no reason. He was just trying to hold her, ah, don't just stop, don't just stop. She did my, her best friend was crying. The male best friend was crying, don't do, why are you like this, don't do. She was like, leave me, leave me. Don't do, said you never, you never told her about your first marriage, and that you have kids um, um, outside by the look, a nine months old and a two years old um, child. She said he called her, I watched the interview. No, it's not true. It's never true because um, I met Tonto. You know, she she likes social media. I don't like social media. She's all she was all about uh, Mr. X. This that that. So someone attacked her page. Do you understand? That was when I just met Tonto. Someone attacked Tonto's page and. Uh, because like Mr. X is blah 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 blah, husband stature, don't go, leave my husband alone. Everyone, I mean, it was, it went viral. My old wedding picture, so how come? You don't know I was married before? How? Do you understand that? 
and uh, it was like seven months after I went to Potanko to play a diary. So, how come? Something that was everywhere, you were packed. It was on newspapers. That Toto's Mr. X was married. And now you don't know that I was married before I got married to you. The lie. And uh, anyone that has a two year old boy or girl for me should come out to the social media for nine months old. I'm well educated, I don't do like that's why I'm very hungry to have a family. I don't do um, I mean I don't do uh, different women, different kids. Again, two years old child and nine months. You know, I'll be happy to train my children. Well all life. Why are they calling Tonto? Why are they not calling my mom? Is it true that the GMC truck uh, is an internet picture? The one you, uh, you bought for your son as a birthday gift. And also, you hear that some of the gifts that she displayed on the social media, the luxury items that they were not bought by you, bought by her. No, that's not true. That's not true. <coughs> I love to buy gifts. Oh, I'm a busy man. I'm too occupied. I work, work, work to to the point that I break down at times. So I buy goods at times when I want to compensate. So I just make a. I bought the goods. I have all the goods I bought, but I stopped that from displaying those goods. Just recently, because uh, even the Rolex she, she was putting on uh, last week, she said that that Rolex was not on because I stopped that from all this way. Yeah, I bought the GMC for my son. As I said, and I wanted to make a surprise that that for him. Unfortunately, I did have access to him on his left. Those gifts were uh, all used, including the uh, Rolex. Just like me, you won't find anything in the world in your life. Or I have to go to our children's lives. I actually bought those gifts and I have those the back of them. And the GMC is real. But I got it for King. Well, I was able to say to present it to me. Or even now that I know other things to do. I know some day who will be to put that in. I think basically um, she did leave the house because of domestic violence because I was not even around when she left the house. And she packed everything, all her belongings. I had two trucks, according to the name. But um, I had this discussion with her about uh, going to Rio because of what's been happening so far after she went back to him. But I think that's the main reason why she left the house. Are you open to reconciliation? Actually, we've tried. Uh, I've tried up to nine times. The last time was when uh, I invited the dad and uh, the night chief. That was much second at all. So each time we try to with her, the next day she blocks me. She, she, you know, she pretends as if uh, we're going to be cool. I still have uh, pictures on my Instagram. So I'm not sure. I don't think she's ready. Thank you, Emmerich, for coming through. I'm not going to let Churchill.
as we all know, I'm a philanthropist. I am against domestic violence. I have never raised my hand on any woman, and I will never. My wife was pregnant, and she gave birth to King, and there was nowhere she was pregnant for four months. She lost this pregnancy. Never. It never happened. I'm here to clear, to clear my name. I'm here to clear the name of my family and my brother. Thanks for coming to The car she said she sold, the Prado, I mean, I, I still have the original document, so I don't know how she sold the car. You know, and in the system, um, it's not showing that the car is sold or the car is missing. The car is still registered under um, Big Churchill Avenue Limited. So she was lying. 